immersing ourselves in an experience. <laughs> this next story is literally a movie that you wouldn't want to be a part of. That's what it sounds like. So basically, the Dubai police recently foiled a smuggling attempt of 500 kilos of pure cocaine into the country in an operation dubbed Scorpion. The drugs were hidden within the structure of a shipping container, having a street value of more than 500 million dirhams, which equates to 136 um, million US dollars. So I think that's seven houses in Bel Air. <laughs> I was gonna say, that's, that's, like, that's like seven rich people houses. That's, that's 136 million. That's, that's like hundreds and hundreds of houses. I know, I, I, yeah. Not in Bel Air though. Apartments and do, we're advertising an apartment with press contacts. <laughs> By the way, they have, they have apartments from 386,000 dirham in Afrijan. So that's no anyway, <laughs> I digress. I didn't read the script yet for that. Um, <laughs> so, according to the Dubai police, the operation is the greatest narcotic seizure in the region. The drug bust has led to the arrest of a Middle Eastern gang member who was acting as a middleman for the international drug cartel within the country. The police received a tip of a large amount of pure cocaine um, being transported in a cargo container, which led to them forming an investigate, which led to them forming an investigative unit after attempt after monitoring the suspect. Sorry, my bad. Um, the police caught the suspect red-handed and opened the container in his presence. And lo and behold, narcotics worth 500 million dirhams were found in the container. Thoughts. Uh, <laughs> one of the biggest drug busts in the region in history, so huge. Um, first thought is why? What? Uh, who knew that people were attempting this when Dubai police are so on point? Literally, like not what, like nothing slips them, mm. like nothing at all. And a, I would be terrified to even approach the idea of literally doing anything that's illegal. Not that I'd want to. Factual. <laughs> and B, you know how on point they are over here. Like, nothing runs by anyone here. We're in a super safe country. Um, every, the uh, federal authorities do everything they can to make sure that we're in the safest environment we possibly can be in. Why would you want to attempt it? True. Why? However, my favorite thing about this whole story is the video. I know. Like, like, like I see it come out and I think um, if you're watching on Facebook you can see the, the video that Dubai police share. So it's called Operation Scorpion and like you said at the beginning, it's the movie you don't want to be in because it literally looks like an action movie and you hear like the, it's the, the sound and the audio quality is fantastic and you see it happen and it's so hard to believe that there's, there's this man and his you know, white, white yeah. wife beater who's actually part of this international cartel that Dubai police have just picked up and we're seeing it. It's so real. I know, it's, an, it's literally insanity. It doesn't feel real at all. Um, and also Dubai has so many Scared things Scared thinking of it. I'm like, don't, don't come at me in my house. <laughs> Why would you want to approach that lifestyle in Dubai of all places? There's literally something to do every day of the year. <laughs> and drugs should be one. So don't get involved in <laughs> yeah, a 500 literally. million dirham sting operation. Um, we've seen a number of these types of videos before with Dubai police. Um, and it usually is uh, when there is a kind of a massive um, concerted effort involved. Like I remember the, the Hush Puppy video that was dropped. And that was kind of a, a move along, like the FBI were involved and there was um, yeah. uh, international crime people involved yeah, as well. There, it, was, it was three groups together and that video was just as uh, surprising and shocking. But this is Operation Scorpion, one of the biggest drug, um, not heists, busts, busts in history uh, in the region. And Dubai Police dropped the video. And if you're watching on Instagram, we also shared it on feed yesterday. So I recommend checking hey, it out. Um, but that wasn't the only bust recently, by the way. Um, In terms of Dubai police, uh, they also uh, fo- not foiled, they uh, found a corpse in Naif. Um, and it's just an interesting uh, mix of two kind of very surprising drug stories, because in this case, uh, the man had tragically died. He had 41 pills in his body. Yeah. Uh, 44 had come out. So he was obviously a trafficker, a smuggler. Um, and Dubai police found him in that state. Um, it's, it's a very sad, shocking story, but also the fact that uh, uh, Any of these stories should be a reminder that drugs are just uh, uh, not it. Not it. <laughs> 
in this country. Like nothing uh, good comes out of it. Nothing good comes out of it. Um, not part of our society at all. And I think uh, a lot of residents are very appreciative of that. Um, and the police take an incredibly hard line to anyone involved in uh, drugs. So steer clear. Better safe than sorry. Better safe than sorry. That's all we gotta say. That's all we gotta say. <laughs>